Hi guys, in this video, I will be explaining you all the steps which are necessary for creating multiple branches and switch between different branches. So we will start. But before that, I just need to say you one thing. If you have not subscribed my channel, please subscribe so that I will be motivated to upload more and more videos for you. So let's start. So in GitHub, first of all, you need to create a branch. If you have already the branch, then it's OK. But I, I will create everything from scratch. Let us assume this branch name is demo. Then I will create a repository. Once the repository is created, then you just need to copy this remote address. OK, then go to that place wherever all your code files are there. At that position, you need to open your terminal. In the terminal, you need to write git init. First step is to write git init init for initialization of GitHub. Then you need to write git add dot, then git commit minus m and any message. But right now, I will write initial commit as my commit message. Then I will add that remote. Once the remote is added, then you need to write git push origin master. If you'll write git push origin master, it will ask you for yes or no. You can write yes. Then it will ask for pass phrase. If it asks, just enter the pass phrase. Once you will enter the pass phrase, it is showing it is done. OK, so now you can go to your VS code and refresh to check whether all the coded code files are here or not. For dummy purposes, I have only uploaded a single file. But for you, if you have multiple number of files, it will be uploaded. OK, so right now you can see we have a single branch that is master branch. But let us assume we in future need multiple number of branches where different people can work or I will work on different branch. So I need to create multiple branch. So for creating multiple branch, you need to write git branch to check what are the branches are there. Right now only master branch is there. I will write git branch. Let us assume the one more branch I will create test. So I have written git branch test. So now if you will check git branch, it is showing two branches. One is master, one is test. So right now it is in green color master. That means I am in master branch, not in test branch. So I need to write git checkout. Means I will check out from one branch and I will go to another branch. Then I will write test. So it is showing switch to branch test. That means it already switched. If I will right now write git branch, then you can see the green color is test one, not master one. That means I can do any kind of changes in this branch and then I can push it to GitHub. So if I'll write code dot to open my VS code, then we will do some changes and push it to GitHub. Let us assume here previously written is ABCD. I will add one more line. I will add my name Abhishek Nayak. And then please subscribe for more videos. I have written my channel name Web Coder Abhishek. Then I have written please subscribe for more videos. Okay. Once this is added, then I need to open my terminal. For opening the terminal, you can go here and click on the terminal, new terminal. Then it will be opened. Okay. Then you need to add this. Right now, I will check which branch is it. You can see it here. It is showing test branch. So I will add these changes. Git add dot git commit minus m. Then here you need to write commit changes. I will write sub message means subscription message. Then I will push it git push origin. Now you need to write test. You don't need to write master. You need to write test because right now you, you are in test branch, not in master branch. Then here you need to write enter the passphrase. Whatever the passphrase is there, you need to write. If you don't have passphrase, then it's OK. Otherwise, just click enter. It would be completely pushed. Now, if you will see test had a recent push less than a minute. Previously, it is only having a single branch. But you can see right now it contains two branch. One is the test branch and one is the master branch. So there are two branches. If I will see what is the code in the master branch that is A, B, C, D. But if I will go to my test branch and then check what is that inside that test branch, you can see A, B, C, D is there. 
web code or abhishek is my channel name so please subscribe for more videos okay so the message is there in the test branch but there is same initial message is there in master branch similarly we can create multiple branches and we can also switch so now if i again need to go to my master branch i need to write git checkout master that means it switched to master branch and now it is showing a b c d message now it is not showing that a b c d um, after that what i have written the messages like subscribe my channel all that is not showing and in this video i am showing you the process how to create multiple branches but in next video will be much more interesting because in that video i will be showing you the trick which will help you to merge these branches means there are multiple branches master test how to merge these branches so that is very interesting video so please subscribe like this video if this video is very much helpful for you that's all for today guys thank you for watching